YouTube, Big T Express. Um, coming at you again. This time we're talking about my Matchbox uh, 1969 Camaro 396 SS um, convertibles. Um, of course, we know a little while back they did release this gold one in the mainline Matchbox. Seemed to go pretty quickly. I was very uh, felt very fortunate to find one on the pack. And then it got me thinking about some of the older castings. Um, and I went back and actually picked up a couple um, of, from the 35th anniversary uh, Superfast editions. And I found the green one first. Very nice detail. Um, we got marker lights uh, and tail lights. Um, the wheels, uh, you know, they, they don't look very good on this car. Um, and then this is the other one, or one of the other ones. There could be more. I'm, I'm really not sure, um, but uh, a little more, I guess, original looking. The wheels are a little more down to earth. Um, a little bit better painted detail as far as the bright work, number plate, tail lights, um, even headlights and emblem on the front. So this one um, is pretty close to my favorite of the three, even though it's kind of a, honestly off color. but. Good looking casting. I think Matchbox, um, especially for what they charge for the cars, just the same, you know, on the on the mainline cars, they you know they're a dollar. I think they do a little bit better job at times on the detail than Hot Wheels, and it's odd because they are owned by the same company, obviously Mattel. So, well, guys, let me know. What do you think? Do you like the Matchbox at all? I, I've got quite a few Matchbox. I don't mind them. I uh, I really enjoy the Matchbox as much as I do the Hot Wheels. Um, what do you guys think? Questions, comments, smart remarks? Let me know.